Hey guys, it's me again on this video. Um, this is gonna be part four, I believe, of my Kirby Superstar Ultra Let's Play. Yeah, I know I haven't played this in a while, but I'm finally back. Um, and I'm actually playing it on a normal DS this time instead of my 3DS because I found this yesterday in a box, and it, in the box was also my GameCube. Well, no, not yesterday, the day before. We had my GameCube and my N64. Rubik's Cube, um, some old figures, pretty much all sorts of stuff, um, sure my phone was just letting me know that my battery's halfway, well, not halfway, but, um, it's low, um, that's okay, um, <clears throat> today we're gonna be starting the Great Cave Offensive, um, which is uh, the second longest mode in the game, um, I believe, so just, yeah. So smart, Kirby. So smart. Um, just falling down cliffs. I can see better on my camera than I can my actual DS. Oh, it's just because of the angle I have it at. Never mind. Um, I guess we can say it's my first time playing, even though it's really not. Okay, hunt treasures as you explore this huge cave. It is pretty huge. How cool this place is a, is ripe for adventure. To win, you'll have to look for treasure and make it safe out safely. When you find a chest, stand in front and press down on the control pad. Like that. I got a gold medal. I don't know if that counts as one of my treasures, like if you have to do this to get that or not. But, but, okay. Um... Have you found treasures by pressing? Yeah, okay, I didn't get that. But, cool. Hmm, that wasn't that long. I think I accidentally skipped the rest, but, yeah, accidentally. Uh, yeah, those take a long time, though, I know, so. I want to get through this mode quickly, because, like I said, it's, from what I remember, a pretty long mode. I'm not going to be getting every treasure, and... Oh wow, what an error that was, that was a typo. It said press down in front of a treasure chest, but I pressed up to do it. Because, I mean, I pressed down before that, and it didn't do anything. But, um, since I know I'm not going to be getting every treasure chest, but I will get the obvious ones. Like, where it's a, oh, there's got to be a treasure chest here, it's so obvious. So, this, gold coin, um, yeah, so... This is gonna be pretty easy. I was playing this mode earlier on. Actually, I'm not gonna tell you. Yeah, I was just playing. The, all I'm gonna say is I was playing this mode earlier. Um, and it, like I said, it's pretty easy. Um, sure, I can't safely get through there now. Okay. Mm. We'll have to come back to them, then. We'll just go through here. Now that the room is reset. Stay away from there. Okay, let's eat that, Knuckle Joe. So we have a partner. Um, You guys still haven't voted for a name for my partner, but... And that's okay. You be careful. Don't be a stupid partner. You guys, guys, your partners are often stupid in this game, but hopefully mine isn't that stupid. Um, <laughs> just break that for the heck of it now that we don't need it anymore. Just throwing people. Um. So, oh, so this is the first something awesome in front that's only in this. Well, no. Oops, I kicked my trains. Um. But there's something awesome that's mainly in this. I mean, it's in a few other modes, but this is where you'll most remember it from. Like, oh. But, yeah, you'll see that when it comes. Um, oh my gosh. No, okay. Okay, 
I don't know that I'm going to be able to get that, but... Okay, um... Wait, can, if I throw that onto this, will that work? Nope. Um... I don't know, I want to get this treasure that's over here. It's an easy one to get. No! Oh gosh, I'm... I think I give up. Um... No, whatever, whatever, I give up. Um... Great Cave Offensive can be tricky with some of its treasures. Which is one of the reasons I'm not getting all of them. I'm not 100%ing this game, as I am pretty sure I said in episode 1. Um, so, see, this is one of the obvious ones. Um, Lucky Cat. Huh, I, I don't know what else you would expect from a Japanese game. I think Lucky Cats are Japanese, but um, yeah, what else would you expect? So, I don't know that there are any treasures up here. But... Um, nope, that just leads you back to way earlier in the thing, just go through here, oh my gosh, this is annoying, oops, sorry guys, um, gosh, gotta be really careful if you want this treasure, okay, Oh yeah. Oh my gosh, my partner's so stupid. But yeah, we can do this easily. This this mode's easy for like for the most part it's easy. Um There are some annoying parts probably. I mean every mode has its annoying parts, but I don't know that this has any that are too bad. Oh, we just want to, I don't know, get rid of that. Because we're going to want this waddle D here, if we're going to get this treasure over here. That's the thing about this mode, like, it gives you the power-ups you're going to need most of the time, like, soon before you're going to need them. So, you know, if there's, like, just that one guy with that power, you probably want to get it. Oh my gosh, yep, the first reference. This mode's full of references, guys. References. Um, this one's a reference to Metroid. It's the screw attack. Yeah, there you go, Metroid. I actually have Metroid, I might do a no, I, I don't think I'm going to do a play on Metroid, actually. Because I don't want to start over, I'm so far into the game. So, yeah, maybe some other time after I beat the game. Okay, um. Okay, there, that thing was bug- this was bugging me earlier. So I couldn't figure out what to do. Oh, there's a treasure, oh my gosh. Chigo candy. Okay. okay. Is this a treasure in here? Oh no, it's a s healing slash saving room. Okay, well, yeah. That's cool. Um, that probably would have been a great place to end the video, so. I don't know. Um, I'll get one more treasure and then I'll end it. So, yeah, probably. That's probably what I'll do. So, let's just go find one last treasure for this video. Uh, that'll work. So, let's just break through there. I right, can't break through here. Mm hmm. Ah, uh, is this what I do? No. Oh, I see where to go. Okay. Oh, sorry. I was moving a little far there. 